So if you're out around uh, Governor State University in University Park, Illinois, and you're geocaching, that was the geocache called Frame. And you start off right there by the sculpture. And now I'm on my way to the one that's called Phoenix. Goose. If I don't find it on the first whack, Magoo has set me up with three more options of coordinates that he calculated that might help me find it. Phoenix. This is one thing I really like about geocaching is that it takes you out to places that you normally don't go to. Places like this sculpture park and woods. It's just great to get out, see some places that you normally don't go to. Oh man, it's taking me by those geese. Hopefully I don't get attacked by any geese. All right, so we're successful on this one. The first waypoint that uh, I went off to was not accurate. The hint was base of tree. And when I got there, I noticed that all the trees right by that little lagoon area had been wrapped around with some kind of chicken wire to keep animals from like biting away at it. But that was a good indicator for me not to spend too much time on it. I had three more options. There was one that just sort of seemed like it was up closer to the artwork. So I went out to that one and lo and behold, I looked down and there it was. I'll show you a little bit of what I'm talking about. So this is the said geocache. And, uh, ah, it's got ants. Uh, you'll encounter that once in a while. I'm gonna open this bad boy up, sign the log, BG Proud, which is my geocaching handle, and Proud Cachers, which is Magoo's caching handle. Success to the both of us. <laughs> I'm gonna make a note that they need to add some more paper to this. So the thing about this is pretty cool is that when you post a note saying that you found it, you can also request that a geocache have maintenance by the cache owner. So if you notice that something's jacked up, torn, and the container's missing, you can leave a message on the site for the, the geocache owner and then it's their duty and their responsibility to go back out and uh, take a look at it and make sure everything's okay. God, these ants. Nature. Time to put it back. And there you have it. Geocaching success, which is so almost unheard of with us. So today was a two for two win at the Nathan Manilow Sculpture Park walk thing and uh, yeah, I'm really excited that uh, I was able to find these bad boys. I couldn't have done it without Magoo. He's my numbers man. He number crunched things. He took the photos of the artwork when we were here last time. And he's the, he's the puzzle master. So uh, today was a success. And uh, I get to go home and log that. I found these bad boys. And that's always a good sense of accomplishment.